Hi guys, the day is here. I am flying to Miami. It doesn't feel real. Like everyone keeps asking me like, are you excited? Do you feel like it's sunk in yet? No, it has not sunk in that I'm going to Miami. I don't think it will sink in until I've landed. I meet some of the staff members and actually get on the boat. It's only gonna be then that it actually seems real. Like even now we leave in an hour and it just doesn't feel real. I just need to finish packing a few little bits and pieces and then we're gonna head to the airport. I'm going from Heathrow to Miami. It's the longest flight I've ever been and it's the first flight that I've ever been on my own. It's a 10 hour flight. Um, the flight is at two and we land at seven and I'm hopefully getting met by someone from the cruise. I'm staying in a hotel overnight and then my first day is officially tomorrow. It also looks like I'm not wearing a top. I am. I'm just wearing a little black vest. But anyway, come with me to the airport. Come travel with me for the first time on my own to Miami. I hope you guys do enjoy and if you do then please remember as always to leave a huge thumbs up and please remember to subscribe if you haven't already. So yeah it's a big big day today. The first time leaving home in 24 years. I've never moved out or lived away from home ever. So come with me to the airport, come fly with me to Miami and yeah here's to a brand new chapter. Right so I'm at the airport, I'm not gonna lie, a few tears were shed or a lot of tears were shed a few security I had the whole work done as always bag check drug swab i even had the security ask me if i was over 18 which i'll take as a compliment so first things first i need to go into boots and pick up some shampoo hair gel body wash and an iphone charger now for the most important thing just been in boots and wh smith and i went and got myself an apple charger 30 pounds i have an apple charger but i kind of got told off by my mum for the state of it yeah it wasn't good um, I managed to get everything except for hair gel, so that's something I'm going to have to get when I'm on the cruise because I had a massive pot of hair gel, like the eco one, but it would my case was overweight, so it had to go. I think my gate is open. My flight, of course, is the only flight that is delayed, so I think I'm going to go ahead to the gate now. I mean, I am tempted to have a look in Dior and all the designer shops, even though there's nothing in the bank account, but they're all like, and I'm there. It is tempting. Right, so I've made the gate and I'm waiting to board. Honestly, it is so scary navigating an airport on your own. Like I've been in airports many a times, but never on my own. So yeah, even if it's just been me and Josh, there's always someone there. So going through an airport, going through security, finding everything that I need to find, going to the gate, yeah, on my own. <laughs> so yeah, I'm literally just waiting to board. They're calling numbers as we speak. I've got an aisle seat as well, which is brilliant. I just did all of these stuff from between people people but yeah, it's all starting to seem real now i'm getting met on the other side it's a 10 hour flight as well which is the longest flight i've ever been on i'm gonna edit a few videos i think i don't want to sleep because i land at seven um in the evening so i don't want to like not sleep i don't want to sleep loads on the flight and then not be able to sleep when i get there and then i think i get picked up at 10 o'clock tomorrow to go on to the cruise it's so weird because i've been talking about this for ages and now it's happening and i'm just about to board my first flight on my own to America to work my dream job. Playing trances, going all to different places, different planets. Watch your aura pass me by, losing balance. What if we run out of time and second chances? Empty handed, you left the fast life. Just like that, I'm here. I look so oily. It was so humid outside and it was a bit of a stress trying to navigate, not Heathrow Airport, but Miami when I got out here because I've never been to Miami before. I'm in the hotel, I'm staying here overnight. I've met a few crew members. I'm just waiting for who I'm sharing a room with to join me. I'm hoping they're part of the entertainment crew because at least that's one person that I'm gonna know when we go tomorrow. But yeah, it was a 10 hour flight. 
it was pretty long my knees were starting to ache at the end but i managed to be productive i managed to edit a video i actually re-watched the barbie movie as well had a little sleep do you know what the perk though of doing a dietary request because i don't eat meat is that you get your food first so absolute win so i think the plan of action now is to go i think they've got a restaurant because i've got a food voucher so i think i'm going to go to the restaurant and have some dinner even though it is nearly 10 o'clock and i think they said pickup was at 8 30 tomorrow and i want to get up because i want to do my makeup i want to look presentable for my first day do you know what i'm not even that hungry so i might just go down and have like a little starter we shall see i don't think this vlog is very long but anyway a nice short and sweet vlog um it is quite scary traveling on your own i mean i had three suitcases and little old me navigating it i think at the end when i was trying to find out how to get to the hotel suitcases were flying everywhere they were falling over i was that annoying girl with loads of suitcases who couldn't move them but anyway thank you so much if you have gone to the end of today's vlog i'm so shiny that is wow I hope you guys have enjoyed and if you have then please remember as always leave it a huge thumbs up and please remember to subscribe if you haven't already. I've also still got the label in. It's cute, it's fine. Um, but anyway, here's to an exciting new chapter. A very emotional day. Yeah, it's honestly like the idea now that I'm not seeing Josh and my sister for six months. Hopefully, fingers crossed, my mum and dad are coming out halfway through um, to see me. But yeah, that is actually crazy a whole new chapter a scary one i just want to meet some people so i have some familiar faces um with me for the next two weeks of training before i go on to my main six month contract but anyway guys thank you so much if you have gone to the end of today's video here is to hopefully an amazing new chapter full of amazing memories that i will cherish forever in florida i've never been to florida either but anyway, guys, um, I'll stop rambling um, because I'm going to make this really short vlog really long if I carry on. But anyway, um, I hope you guys have enjoyed watching today's video. I love you all so much and I will see you next time with a brand new video. Bye. Can we trust this to let us know?